Wizards of Nay. These imps are guarding the Devil King's tower, protecting the Devil King who kidnapped your best friend. Do this to cast your most powerful spell. Flee! Oh. I've been defeated! Hello, wizard. I'm the janitor imp. You're here for the Devil King, who kidnapped your best friend. How rude. Yeah, I'm not going to stop you. Good luck, wizard. Oh, right. Right. Ah, you're here. The Devil King is your best friend? That's right. Your best friend is actually the Devil King! Me! What with... <laughs> what was that? Pathetic! Your bravery stat is too low! You can't cast any spells! Well, any last words? Too bad! Come on! <laughs> Hey. Sorry, I'm late. <laughs> Are you playing those forbidden video games again? They're illegal, you know. Because they use that word. Nay. <laughs> I can't believe you're playing them. What if you get arrested? I'm just teasing you. Oh, I can't believe it's your first day working at a real office. We've been applying so hard for one of those. And now you have one. I'm really proud of you. Oh, so I have something as a little celebration. Ta-da! I made you a lunchbox. And I cooked you lunch too. It has all your favourites. I hope you like it. Uh oh, wait. One more thing. Um, since you have, like, a real job now and I'm still looking... Would you be able to pay this month's rent again? I know we talked about this. I promised I wouldn't ask again and again and again. But I mean, I'm still looking hard, you know. And hopefully I can find a proper job too. But yeah, is that okay? You know what? If I keep you any longer, you'll be late. Let's talk about it later. I hope your first day of work goes really well. Have fun. Call me after lunch. Welcome, interns. Hey, you're late. What's your excuse? Hmm? Answer me, intern. Oh, great, a quiet one. You can't just mumble around here. I'll fire you before lunch if you don't learn how to talk. Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> great joke, supervisor. <laughs> you don't like my joke? I'll fire you. Kidding. Again, also a joke. We like to have fun around here. What a fun workplace. Anyway, get to work, you lazy. Oh, right. Almost forgot. Motivation speech incoming. Welcome, interns. Welcome to your first day at our company. It might seem scary, but it'll be a big learning experience. You learn so much about how the world works, but no that you have to be open. You have to say yes to everything around here. Yes. Great start, but I mean literally, okay? Yes. Good. Literally say yes all the time. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Wonderful. It's all about being a real team player. You just gotta be positive. Yeah. So let's have a practice run. I am hungry and I really want that lunchbox. I say, hey intern, give me that lunchbox. What do you say? Come on, give me your lunchbox. I'm kidding. Nobody's gonna take your lunchbox away, intern. Not yet. 
<laughs> it's a joke. Relax. <laughs> 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 Great! Have fun! And, uh, where are our desks? They are somewhere around the vending machines. So make your way to your desks, and when you get there, work! Just absorb all that experience, you know? And don't forget, be open. Say yes, and you'll get promoted or something. Ooh, I'm gonna get that promotion! You do say yes a lot. Yes. Intern, make me coffee with milk, okay? Just do it, okay? Just get me coffee, okay? Oh, I'll take a coffee as well, but without milk. Why are you still here? Hurry up! The printer is jammed. Fix it, will ya? Good intern. Welcome to the intern corner. A bit icky, I think. Oh, it's just... Authentic. Yes. Authentic. Great. Oh, your desk is over there, behind the vending machine. Hey, dorks. I need two interns to do some lame and boring work. Yes. Follow me. Uh, yes. Hey, intern. Funny story. Remember when I asked you to give me your lunchbox? Turns out, I actually forgot my lunchbox at home. And I need one for later, so... Give me a lunchbox. In turn, I am your supervisor. And did we not just go over how you are always supposed to say yes? Well, I know I did a great job teaching it. So this must be your way of saying yes. Thanks, in turn. Start your internship and get destroyed by your co workers. Your supervisor probably just stole your lunch. And the problem is, you're too scared to say anything. No. Well, you can do it, I believe in you. No. You need three things no. one, no. this tape, no. two, confidence. That's right, believe in yourself. Listen to your heart. You gotta believe. Good. The other thing you need is just one word. The word no. Just do this. Say it with me. No. 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 Come on, try it on this jerk. Mate. No. Whoa. Whoa, not bad. No. Do it again. No. Unchain the printer. No. Yeah. No. You are so good. Listen, I know it's outrageous to say no these days. But if you don't use it, jerks like these lunch stealers will always win. Do you want that? No, right? But wait, there's more! Before destroying jerks with a juicy no, confuse the heck out of them by laughing at them. Do this to laugh at this dude. In turn, do this no. my confidence! <laughs> Funny, right? Laugh at idiots to feel better. I am no. I'm actually small! You did it! No. You are now equipped against mean people! Now go out there and get your lunchbox back! One last thing, don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel. And leave a comment below if you've got anything to say. I'd love to hear from you. Good luck. No, no. I jammed the printer. No, Did you make my coffee? I don't see coffee. Hey, wait a minute. You didn't bring coffee. But I asked. I'll punish you. Just you wait. Okay, so I don't know how to punish anyone. Go punish yourself. Yeah, go do that now. I need soda. Half strawberry, half grape, and zero sugar. Good! Did you see my new no. life? Excuse me? What? No. Oh. Hey, be nice. No. Yikes! Fire that intern supervisor. The supervisor? Hey, keep it down. I need to concentrate. I have a lot of work to do, you know. Much better. Hey, let's run it. More walking, okay? Thank you for listening. Is it wrong to want more? I 
just don't want to stay here forever, is that bad? It's not like we were born office workers. Why shouldn't I want to do more than just work here? Stupid question, I guess. Go away! The lunchbox is mine! You work late today. Because I don't want to work late today. That's it. You're out no. of house just projecting! Please no. go! Photosynthesis! Photosynthesis! I'm not your supervisor. I'm just a plant. Just a hungry plant doing plant things. Plant, plant, plant. Mmm, delicious sunlight. Uh, okay, is the intern gone? Yikes! Clean the coffee! Hello, buddy. Hello. We are out of coffee, buddy. Fine, I'll buy them myself then. We need milk. Everyone keeps telling me to go buy milk. You go buy it. I don't even like milk anyway. Please leave the kitchen, intern. You are out of line. Out of line indeed. If you don't move, I'll have to use force. I'm counting down. Three, two, one. Lift off. Okay, that's it. Ha ha, yes. Flip the tape. Flip the tape. There are more lessons. What happened? Did you get crushed by some jerk who won't listen to you? No? What a butthead. Don't worry. I'm here to teach you a new kind of no. It's the charge no. It's easy. All you have to do is hold your no. And then let it go. But be careful not to overcharge, my friend. I am so stupid. No. Oh, amazing. Whoa, crazy. Unfortunately, a charge no can take a lot of energy. You need to raise your confidence, believe in yourself. What can help is to make them feel awkward, which is where you can really use the laughing technique. Give him another charge no. And if you can't, try laughing at him. Try it again. No. Amazing. <laughs> that was awesome. But be careful. Not everyone reacts the same way. You've got to try different things to see what happens. You're ready. Good luck. Oh, dear. Hey. I told no. you. Oh. Whoa. Holy moly. Oh, boss, help. That handy. No. Oh. Copy these papers. Copy them! Copy them! Can't hold them any longer! I'll put them on your desk. Make way! No! Ah! Uh, what? Not Make good! Let's smile! No. Okay, fine, I suck! Wait, 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 wait! No! Uh, what? Hey? Whoa! What is this madness? Is that a new intern? Hey, intern, turn off that music! Bosses, I'm so sorry! Uh, who are you? That's the supervisor of my floor. I'm so sorry to interrupt your meeting. This intern chased me and overcame me. This intern? Yes, this person was disrespectful and mean and... You were intimidated by an intern? Yes, that intern is using... That word again. What word? Tell them. Come on. I don't get it. We don't allow weakness in this company. Yes, and that's why you have to go. What? Wait, please, have mercy. You are fired! Ah! Oh! <sighs> well... Excellent firing technique. Thank you. Zero room for weakness here. Now I should fire that troublemaking intern as well. Zero room for disrespect here. Wait, I need a new supervisor. And I do like how intimidating that intern is. Don't you want to... No. Oh! Whoa! Cool. Wow. What strength. Yeah, you have to work with us. Yeah, come on. It'll be great. You have exactly the qualities we need. You're right. We won't take, um, not yes for an answer. In fact, 
You're hired! Let's celebrate! Intern, bring some coffee for your bosses and your supervisor. Yes, right away. Here you are, boss. Fresh cups of coffee. Oh, where's the supervisor? Right here! What? Are you kidding me? No. Congratulations on your promotion, intern. Too bad we can't move you to a better desk yet, though. The place is just so full, you know. And it's a real bummer that the president fired your supervisor. He sounded like such a great guy. And they just threw him away. Makes you think. I mean, if I was president, I don't think I could fire someone. Ever! After all, we're all buddies here in this office. How's it hanging, man? Huh? Just one big office family. Wait, this is your desk? Unbelievable! Everyone! Can you believe that the intern has to work like this? What? Look, I can't just let you work here like this. We're a family. I'll have to sort this out myself. How about you get a cup of coffee or something? Take a little break at the water cooler. I'll fix it for you. That's what friends do. Enter. Yeah. Uh -uh. Hey, stop. No. I should have expected this. You are so rude. She's right, you know. It's okay. They'll learn their lessons soon enough. Psst. Hey, do you want to listen to my dreams? Someday, I'm going to quit this place and be a baker. Doesn't that sound wonderful? Anyway, back to the grind. Thanks for listening. Intern, take these used tissues to the trash. After all, you can't skip work even if you're sick. I guess I'll do it myself. Hey, you! Are you enjoying a cool drink of water? Hydration is important for your health. And as you enjoy that cool water, think about saying an ice cold no. Why is it called a cold no, you ask? Because to do it, you have to imagine you are a penguin in the Antarctic. And this sea lion offers you ice cream, even though he knows you've just had your dessert. Like, ice cream is the last thing you could ever want right now. So as the penguin, you tell this sea lion... No. Just like that. Swap to a cold no by doing this. To swap back to your heated no, do this. Let's try a cold no on this doofus. Work through lunch. No. So cold. Yes! You are unbelievable. Oh, hey. You want to learn another trick as well? Just clap at them before you say no. Do this to clap at their ridiculousness. Don't you clap at me. Ajay! Look at you go! Have fun doing this in the real world. In turn, bring me lunch. Go outside and get me a falafel wrap. I'll pay you when you get back with it. Not with money, of course. You get paid with experience. So much cooler than money. Hey, why are you staring? You know what? You let me out. Forget it. Intern, clean no. up. I need money. Don't get me wrong. I only need it because I won the lottery. You see, I need to pay an advance fee to access the cash. It's two thousand dollars. Can I borrow it from you? Oh, it's okay. You probably don't even have that. Intern, I need you to book. Boing is better. Intern, sit here and do my work. I need to go line up for a copy of this new game that's launching today. It's called Minute of Islands. It's the best. It's by a company called Fitspin Studios. 
exploring mysterious islands, diving into dark catacombs. It's so beautiful. The giants you meet are breathtaking, and the story, wow! It's really cool, intern. You should play it too. After you finish off my spreadsheets. Intern, close your eyes, and ta-da! A window! Anyway, I gotta go. I have a bunch of meetings. Just wanted to look out for my bud. Let's hang sometime. See ya! Out! <laughs> Buddy! Nice to see you! Fix these spreadsheets. They need to be done before the end of the day. I just can't be bothered anymore. You don't have to do much. Basically, just fill them out. I didn't get around to starting work on them. Oh, whatever. Staring contest! Are you ready? Go! <laughs> I think I blinked. You win! Entertain me! I'm so bored of work! Do something funny! Ugh, you're boring. Stop this kerfuffle! What a kerfuffle! Can't stand intense kerfuffle! Go! Got me a room. I need a meeting room upstairs. I want a room just for myself. I could book it myself, but I want you to do it, intern. Good. Just go away. I'm a jerk. Hold. <laughs> Careful. Oh. Wow. Intern, can you please bring this to same? It's important. Thank you so much. He's over there, but I'm a bit too busy. Hmm? I'm busy. Go away. If you have something for me, just throw it in this bin. In the bin? Yes, thank you. Goodbye. I am a door. Mm. I just won again. Hey! My door! Hey! Whoa! Calm down! I'm a poor employee, just like you. I mean, look at my office. It's even darker than yours. Huh? Why are you staring at my lunchbox? Oh, you think this is your lunchbox? No, this is definitely mine. I mean, I get it, though. When I saw yours earlier, I thought, wow, that intern stole my lunchbox. What a crazy coincidence. <laughs> but I can assure you, this one is mine. I would never steal a buddy's lunchbox. I mean... This company is a family. Who would do such a thing? Unbelievable. The nerve of some people. Come on. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, jeez. This place come from. Hello, manager. Welcome oh, back, manager. Your preheated slippers are waiting for you, manager. Do you want us to build the chocolate fountain again? Uh, in turn, isn't this weird? Crazy, even. Where did all this come from? I didn't even know this existed. Manager, your cherry blossom trees arrived and were planted. Everything is ready for your daily constitutional. Uh, this must be some other boss's office. Your manager's statue is done, manager. Uh, uh, I don't know you. Who are these people? I'll investigate. In turn, you should get back to work. Goodbye. Hail, buddy. Well met. Welcome to the buddy plane. This is the office of our manager, a.k.a. Buddy. Are you applying for a position as a buddy? We are actually hiring. The next buddy will help you out. May our buddy ship sail safe. Buddy, hook no. them up. Buddy, sign this contract for me. I only read like half of it, and who knows what it says. So do you mind signing it instead of me? 
Ugh, I guess I'll do it myself. Smile, buddy. Mm. I suck. Buddy, you like this statue? It's pretty great, right? I worked overtime for this. Speechless, I see. Thank you, friend. Buddy, tell me a joke. You like jokes, right? Everyone does. And we are both buddies. That means we are like the butts of the jokes. Ha <laughs> ha! I make myself laugh. Okay, may our buddy ship sail safe. Buddy, that's no. me! Buddy, replace all the trees. I just finished setting up the blossom tree forest. Tomorrow is Flag Forest Day. So tonight, after work, you need to replace the trees. Thank you for that favor. Tschüss! Stop right there. This is very important. I love this garden. Anyway, that's it. May our buddy ship sail safe. Buddy, get some bats. The manager wants bats in this cave. After work, go to the suit and bring some back. May your buddy ship sail safe. Buddy, go back down. Flirt! Buddy, buy me some binoculars. Look at this amazing view. I need to appreciate it fully with some binoculars. The real expensive ones, though. None of those cheap binoculars. Those aren't good for my eyes. May our body ship sail safe. Ah! No. Okay. Ah! We're fighting. No. Having fun, manager? President! Did you change offices? I remember yours being smaller. More pathetic. Um, yes. It's impressive what you can do with a bit of Feng Shui. It's fantastic. I take it. Take it? You all get my desk. This is my new office now. Of course, President. Wait! What about my office? Why? It's going to be even bigger than this one. Oh, really? Yes, because your new office is on the street. You're fired for hiding this from me. Fired? Oh, nice lunch box. Excuse me. Wait, wait please, leave the desk. We're friends, please. I, I demand that you stop right now. Come on, manager. We were never friends. No! Meeting time! Don't break the <laughs> Clean this up. No. I need you to clean up my desk. And remove that pillar. It's sort of in the way. But I mean, like, you don't have to rush. I'm just gonna go and take a break. And if it's not done, I guess I can't work. Cool. See you later. Go try tea and get me a new computer. My old one just crashed. In, uh several different ways. I was just about to win that game of solitaire. Maybe there's a different computer I can start a new game on. Staring contest. You met my junior and I'm here to defeat you. Ready? Go! My eyes! Oh, are you so good at this? Damn it, I blink. You win! I have to report Stop. this to the champion! No. Time sure flies! Is that what you're thinking? 
Well, it can, and you need to slow down to rest and recuperate. Imagine a world where instead of working all seven days, we get to work five days and rest for two. No. Or, even crazier, working four days and resting for three. Until we get those rest days, get some rest at work by using a lazy node. That's right. Instead of mustering up all that energy, just go, nah. And use that energy elsewhere, like at home. No. Swap to a lazy no by doing this. Let's try it on this dweeb. Do my work. I don't want to do oh, it. Okay, then. Yeah, great job. Excellent work. One way to use all that saved up energy is to nod. Give people that hint that you might say yes to make the no just that much more devastating. Just do this to listen and nod at them. I need coffee. That's nah. the meaning that coffee is fine. Yes. Save your energy and time for the important things like life outside of work. Remember, you don't need work or capitalism to self-actualize. Work lazy. No interns allowed on the meet. Don't go in there. Are you sure you're ready for this? The supervisor's a coward, and the manager's selfish. But the president, she's different. She's strong. But I guess you're strong too. You know what? I believe in you. Good luck! Welcome to the meeting room floor. Now your meeting room schedule. If you don't, you've failed as an intern. Look! The dynamic synergy meeting is in the innovation room. The innovation meeting is in the empowerment room. And uh, the meeting room room is booked for personal use. Okay, please make your way. Go haste. Stop. I have to tell you something very important. I just got back from vacation. Isn't that great? And wow, what a vacay I just had. Crazy. I can't believe all the amazing things I did. I spent so much money on all of these experiences. But I guess all good things must come to an end. Turn around and leave. Ah! And that's why I call it power time, not overtime. Ah, good timing. Everyone, this is intern who will tell you more about the topic. Later. She said power time is unpaid. Is that true? On the contract it says paid overtime only. Does it mean that all the power time I did was unpaid? Oh, I guess so, then... Did she say we won't get an evening bonus? Because it sounds like if power time's paid, then it's just pay without all the extra overtime bonuses? Damn, I guess that's right. But we don't get that pay until the end of the year? I mean, I'd like to get that money now rather than later. I can't really wait for the pool to mature. I guess I'll have to take out a loan for this month's rent. Thanks for clearing it up, intern. I wasn't sure what the president was saying, so we'll do it your way. Intern, go to the pharmacy. I partied too hard last night. Please, my head. Oh, dear, I'm going to throw up. Oh, a call? Ah. My call! Don't pick up my food. I left it in the microwave. It was probably done a while ago. It's the garlic tuna casserole. You can pick it out by the smell. I added extra garlic tuna. I can offer you a bite if you get it for me. Okay, I guess I'll get it myself. And that's why I wouldn't call it union. I say it's more of a tear apart here. Oh, good timing! Everyone, this is Intern, who will tell you more about the topic. Later! We only have tear apart union representatives? Which, according to the staff list, are the bosses and security staff? Uh, I guess that means I'm right. And we have to give the Terra Party and money? Even though it's not the same thing as a union? I'm so confused. I'll just keep giving them the 10% of my paycheck. But the president said, real unions only want our money. And that, and I quote, Unions are not in our best interests. 
and they stifle innovation and creativity. None of that sounds right, though. Can the president actually prevent us from starting a union? I mean, I know it says I can be fired for starting one, but does that mean I actually can't start one up? <sighs> I guess I can't. Oh, that's what the president wanted. Got it. Intern, did you get my email? I sent you an email. It said that I wanted you, intern, to get me a coffee tomorrow. Half full fat, half skimmed milk decaf americano, okay? I need it before 9.30 a.m. Don't forget. Morning, intern. Ah. Bad morning. Intern, write the meeting. Ah, intern. Take off your headphones for a moment. Don't worry, you get a chance to put them back on. You're here for this lunchbox, I assume? You know, it's fascinating. It's been a long time since we've seen anyone who could use that word. It's like our plan went too well. Even the supervisor and the manager were soft and complacent. But you see, in turn, I never dropped my guard. I knew someone like you would show up at some point. Someone who can wield that word? No. It's a shame you're still so weak, and you're even using a crutch. Go on, put on your little super suit. It's time for your one on one. Ah. Yes. No. yes. That's it. No. No. <laughs> You got me good, intern. You really did scare me for a moment. You did scare the manager for a moment. I had dared to dream that finally someone might defeat me. I gave you all the rope you could need, intern. Let me show you true power. This is what you could be, intern, if you weren't so weak. You lose, in turn. What's going on? Oh, yes. Here it comes. Finally. You are... Bong. Bong? Bong? Lunchtime! Hooray! Oh, uh, finally. The day was dragging, am I right? What was I doing? Oh, uh, uh, saved by the bell, I guess. We'll continue our talk after lunch, then. Dismissed. Damn it! That was amazing. That intern fought a boss. Wow. <laughs> Let's go to lunch, buddy. We have to talk. Yeah! yeah! Lunch time! That was incredible! Yeah, we can't believe you did it! You actually fought a boss! You must be crazy! Yeah, but the intern still lost. That doesn't matter! That's right! You were brave enough to put your foot down! And to use that word! Yeah, that... Hey, that word is still forbidden and we all know it. I don't even know how you're still employed. I would have fired you by now. Well, a few of us were talking to each other. Will you please have lunch with us? I'm not hearing that word. It's gotta be a yes. Yay! Let's go to the nice park with the food trucks. Oh yeah, let's go. Yeah! Oh, uh... Food trucks? We can just eat at our desk. It's way more efficient. Y yeah. You are right. Okay, well, you two, do that then. We are going to the park. Woohoo! I'll never be able to. Oh? 
You think so? It seems tough, but I do want to say it. Maybe I just need some practice. Maybe later. I wish I could work faster. Uh -oh. You are right. If there's too much work, it's the manager's fault. They can hire more people or coordinate better. I deserve my free time. I'm too scared to do oh. Yeah! These people are my friends. They won't judge me. I'm going to dance! Yeah! I'm glad you joined us, Kato. That word, no. you Yeah, I don't know what I was thinking. This word is powerful, and we should use it for good and tell people of who are in the wrong. My laugh is kind of no. huh? I don't deserve it? Yeah, you're right. Next time, I'll tell him that his face is gross. Ha <laughs> My puns are bad. I like to tell jokes, but no one likes them. I guess I should stop, eh? Yeah, you're right. I'll turn over a new leaf. I guess my puns are all water up under the bridge. Let's get food! Yeah! yeah. Mm, I'm so hungry. One falafel sandwich, please. I'll have a pho and a durum döner, but without onions. Coming right up! Okay, one falafel sandwich. Yay! One pho. Yum! One durum döner. Extra onions. I asked for one without onions. Oh! Uh, um, uh... Would you still take it? No! Okay, I understand. It's our fault. I'll make you a new one. Zero onions. Yay! Yay! That was awesome! You really did it, you mad lad. How do you feel? I feel... Incredible! Let's eat. <laughs> yeah! So good! <laughs> food! I love food! I love lunch! <laughs> Wait a minute! Huh? You don't have any food? Don't you want to eat something? Hey! Wasn't your lunchbox stolen earlier today? Right! I saw that! The supervisor took it! Really? I thought it was the manager! I saw him with it shortly before he was fired! Wait, he got fired? Wait, you didn't know? By whom? <laughs> she took the lunchbox. Wow, okay, that's it. That is it. Yeah, that's it. Friends, we gotta help our new buddy. Let's go back and get that lunchbox back. How? You know how. We use the word new. Oh, uh, not really. It's new. Me? Hmm. Friend, please teach us. Are you in? Are you ready? I can do this. Just a small burger, please. Without onions. But would you like fries with that? Ah, um, uh, whew, this is harder than I thought. Mm -hmm. oh. That's right. No, I'm on a diet and I don't want any fries. Hooray! I'm ready. Go! Dancing is now forbidden in the office. You need to stop all those sick, banging moves right now and never do any of them ever again. I... No! It's part of my self-expression and doesn't bother the people around if me. If it doesn't bother the people around you, then it's okay. Yeah! All right, are you ready? Hit me. Get me a coffee. I'm closer to the kitchen than you are, but I'm lazier. Ugh. Nah. No! 
Make your own damn coffee. I'm so bored of making your coffee for you. Are, are you sure? Yes, say it. He, your puns are bad, and you should feel bad. Sorry, so sorry. That's good. Keep going. Okay, your puns are terrible. Well, to that I say, okay. No. no. You're being unreasonable. I'm ready. Hey, what's happening? Oh, thank you for asking. I... I'm gonna need you to go ahead and stay in all night for a week. What? But my plans... I... <laughs> no! I'm busy this evening. In fact, I'm busy every evening. No more overtime. No more overtime? Hey, President! Hmm? What's this? Oh, hey, nerds. Wait, is lunch already over? I was so busy being amazing that I forgot to eat this lunch. Give that back to the intern. Yeah! Seriously? Pfft. Go back to work. No! Excuse me? What was that? Nothing. <laughs> Tell me. <gasps> what did you just say? <laughs> so rude. Oh, hello, intern. I'm glad you're back early. Now we can finish our meeting. Huh. Where were we? Oh, yes. Your evaluation. What? <laughs> Performance. Have you even done any work today? Zero! Two, cooperation. All those people you could have helped. And yet... Zero! Three, communication. Can you even say anything other than no? Zero! Four, leadership. You lead us fools to hope. Nothing more. Zero! Wow! Hey! <laughs> Good to see you. I was just about to hit up the arcade and... Did you just buy lunch? Where's the lunchbox I made? I understand. Don't worry. It was lame anyway. Hey, had any time to think about, you know, about the rent? It would be so helpful if you could cover for me one more time. What do you say, buddy? Mm, okay, you know what? Take your time. I gotta go anyway. Have a good lunch. You have friends? Huh. Not even much of a friend if he can't handle rent. What a loser. I guess that's why he hangs up with you. So he feels better about himself. What a bunch of losers. Huh. Huh. No. No. Okay, okay. No, no. It's no. Huh. What was that? Uh, that other intern is fighting the president. <laughs> what a bad joke. Seriously, look. Uh, what? I see. I underestimated you. Even in a short time, you managed to become this strong. My final evaluation of your development. Five out of five. The... the intern?
Washington defeated the president? Amazing! Whoa! Yeah! What's this commotion? More rebellious employees? CEO, I... Not you two. Guards! It's time to make things right! Everyone, big company meeting, now! Hey, nice lunchbox. Cool. Ugh, the intern. Oh, you're fired too. You know that, right? The intern! What? The intern! Don't underestimate the intern. Ugh. Okay, if you say so. Can you please get up and pack your things? You can't just lie there. Oh, right. Huh, sorry. Come, my darlings, come! You don't want to miss the show! Uh, seminar, I mean. I, your wonderful CEO, welcomes you, my workers, to say yes more! Working here in our company is more than just work. It's a lifestyle. We're your family now. And family says yes to each other. Family helps each other, grows together. It's time for all of us to open up, to become real team players. It's time to say yes! Do you sometimes feel like you're trapped in a cage? Fun fact! The cage is a metaphor. Life wants to cage you, but you've got to break free. Be yourself. Why not if no one's getting hurt? Be as weird, as strange, as normal as you really are. Break through this metaphorical cage of life. How? With a wacky no! Yeah! Swap to a wacky no by doing this. Try it. I need you no. to do uh, another. Intern, no. you are the responsible. Good job. No, 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 now no, that you no. know how to nod, clap, and laugh, it's time to learn how to respond to requests from coworkers. No, no, Sarcastically. No, no. Use that time to consider everything you'd rather be doing instead. So do this to go, hmm. Pay for my lunch, Intern. I'm no. not even hungry. Another. Intern. No. It is a pyramid scheme. You are so good. Now return, my prodigy. You can do it. Which is why I decided to have... A debate! That's right. It's not enough that I just extol the virtues of yes. We'll pit them against each other to show you who's right and our first contestant. Totally randomly selected from every audience member. Is that intern over there? Yes! This is going to be great. Mm-hmm. Wonderful! What's your name, kid? Uh, Noah. What a cursed name! Don't worry, my dear. I will rescue you. With my CEO powers, I will remove that poisonous word from your name. You shall now be called... Ah! What? Just ah, my blessed intern. Good. Ah will represent the yes side. And on the side of not yes, we'll have a very special guest. It's this other intern who's been causing so much trouble. What's your name, intern? Clear! That is not a name, intern. I'll give you a proper name. Then... One that suits someone like you. You are now called Noah! But hush! Uh, yeah. Of course, we are debating for something more than pride. Yeah. The winner of the debate will be given this lunchbox! Oh, neat. Wait, isn't that your lunchbox? Round one! Cool. First question. Your leader you to skip lunch. What do you say to that? 
Can I answer? Is there a buzzer or something? Just go ahead, Ah. Okay, well, I hate to skip lunch, you know. But if there's a big deadline, I guess that's okay. I mean, I can always have a little lunch al desco. Get it? Like al fresco dining, but on the desk? <laughs> you need to say the word. Huh? The question is, what do you say to that? So the answer is... Oh, yes. He said yes! The correct answer! <laughs> Next question. Your supervisor needs you to stay late. What do you say to that? Uh, well, as long as it's only once or twice a week... Mostly it's three times a week. Three times a week? Right, even then. I think that's still reasonable. The word. If my supervisor needs me to stay late, I say yes. That's the right answer! Next question. Your boss needs you to copy some papers. What do you say to that? Oh, uh... Doesn't the boss have, like, a secretary? Or, you know, the boss could copy the papers themselves? Don't think so. But I guess if they are doing important boss things, like doing some business deals, then I can take care of the paper copying. Yes. Correct! Yes is the right answer! Next question. Your president needs you to take out the trash. What do you say to that? Wait, what? I, I'm, I'm confused. Don't we have janitors? Because trash wasn't in my job description. I, I guess if my desk is messy, I'd clean it. And if the trash was right there, I would take care of it. So, I guess my answer is yes. Right again! Last question. The big one. Your CEO needs you to pay her parking tickets. What do you say to that? What? Hmm? Uh, well, I mean, you, the CEO, needs a favor done. Like your parking tickets paid for? Yes? That's the right answer! But, will he put his money where his mouth is? Huh? It's 25 to park for a day. Oh, okay, um, 5, 10, 25. Uh, I need to pay for two days. Okay, 30, 40, 50, uh, here you go. Your parking tickets. What an amazing display of workplace camaraderie! Everyone cheer for us! Oh, it's nothing, really. <laughs> You're doing pretty badly. <laughs> wow! Now that's what I call a heated discussion. <laughs> Let's take a short break. Okay, no break then. Round two! It's time for questions from the audience. Hello, yes, I have a dilemma. My co-worker plays his music too loud. He just tells me to deal with it. Should I just deal with it? Go! Oh, um, how about wearing your own headphones? Or maybe some earplugs? <laughs> well, I haven't tried earplugs. Yeah, they're pretty cheap. Give it a try. Okay. Oh, amazing! Great job, Ah! Uh. Well, next question. You! Uh, is it normal that my deskmate keeps sniffling? She's tried lots of things, but she just keeps sniffling. Why am I the weird one? What's going on? Answer them! Well, it sounds like she just has a cold. That's pretty normal. Oh, it is? Yeah, maybe get some medicine for her. A nice hot drink. 
lots of tissues. That should help. Oh, wow, okay, thanks. Another satisfied customer. Next question. Yes, you. Hello, yes. Long time listener, first time speaker. Do I have to go to my coworkers' party? I don't want to, even though I like my coworkers. I really do. But not enough to give up an evening for them, you know? Should I go? What do you say to that? Brenda, are you talking about Jim's party? Yeah. Okay, I know what you mean. Yep, Jim's a character. Hey, nobody has to come to my party. Still, I'd say you should go. You know, it's good to be social. And isn't it nice to celebrate with your co-workers? Maybe if you spend some time with them, you'll find that you actually have more in common than you thought. And you'll become better friends. Mm, if you say so. Let the office friendship bloom! Well, time for the next question. You! Tell me what's wrong with you. Do I always have to buy the milk? Like, it's always... Go get us more milk, Gordon. Gordon, we've run out of milk. Go to the store, Gordon, and buy more milk for everyone. It's always me. Well? Um, well, everyone has their own duties and tasks. What's your job title? I'm the Dairy Procurement Officer. I... It's because getting the milk is your job, Gordon? Wait, really? Yeah, dairy is another word for milk. Oh, fine. I guess that does explain a lot. And now, that problem sorted. Next one! Staring contest! <laughs> OMG! This is exciting! <laughs> oh! I blinked! I'm out! <laughs> I saw you blink. You're out. I wasn't playing. <laughs> Noah is still in the game. Impressive. <laughs> I blinked. You win. <gasps> Amazing. Next question. Hey, yeah, I've got one. Oh, it's the real. The real third intern! Say you're the CEO and you've got a bad intern. They're disruptive, not open to feedback, not working. Would you fire them? What a thrilling question! <laughs> Yikes! Noah, please stop breaking the set! Oh, sorry. Hmm? Oh, don't worry about it, Ah. You're doing great. <laughs> Okay, everyone, the final round is coming up. Are you ready? Oh, okay, that's ready enough. Here it comes. The final round. The fire pit. Yay! Oh. <laughs> uh... In the final round, Ah and Noah will fight for their lives. Whoever falls down into the fire pit will be fired. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <clears throat> huh? Oh, um, sorry, my dear audience. Where did the time go? We have to wrap this up. Don't boo me! Quick, final statements. Ah, go! Oh, um, please vote for me because I'm nice and I want to bring a nicer workplace for all. Faster! And your yeses means a nicer workplace. Well put. Noah, final statement. Go! Go! Strong arguments. Yeah! What do the judges say? Time to announce the winner! Ah, wins! Yeah! I did? Wow! Here, your prize. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. I want to thank the parents, friends, co-workers, everyone who's been with me all the way. This one's for you. I love you, Mom. However, I know that this lunchbox belongs to my intern pal here. I'm glad that you can finally have it back now. What? What? Don't you dare, Noah. Uh, yeah, right. This is not cool, Ah. Uh. Give me that. Hey. If you don't respect my show, 
then nobody should get the lunchbox. Hey, now, that's just childish. Shut up, intern! Get back to work! No! What? What? I said no! How dare you! Um, a little help? Don't you know! I have an idea. Ah. It's working! Another one! Ah. Our CEO just got fired? We are free! Guard. Mm. Hey, it's the other intern. Everyone, shut up! This charade is over. This CEO is a fake! What? <laughs> you got me. I'm just an actor. Hi, I'm Steph. I do improv, and I can also sing and play the piano. I can also DJ. So, Jim, if you need someone, call me. That would be great. Leave. Monkey dokey. Follow me at stage step. I do bar mitzvahs and weddings. Okay, bye. Hey, wait a minute. You can't fire staff. You're just an intern. Are you serious? Can't you read the room? I'm the real CEO. What? It finally happened! Our co-work CEO has shown off her true form! Seems like none of the employees knew of the deception. We weren't planning on revealing it so soon. But of course, with so many twists and turns today, our CEO had to plan her cards quick. We can't wait to see how the company deals with this twist. Ah, here comes the CEO, presumably to offer a Q&A session to her faithful employees. Let's watch closely. Silence! It's clear that I've left this company without direction for too long. Well, here comes the new direction for the company. The fun times are over. You do not get to say no anymore. That word will disappear from your tiny brains. Because if I even hear a mention of that word, I will personally destroy you. Not only will I fire you, I will make sure that you never work in this city again. Do you understand? Good. Don't you put that down right now. No! The rest of you, get back to work. Welcome back to our live edition of Covert CEO with me, Mike Rofone. We are back today with the CEO of the company we are on location visiting right now. And have we had a dramatic twist? We've seen her enter one of her office buildings as a new intern. And as she's been working hard, learning about her workers, someone has been shaking the foundation of her company. First, let's talk to our Covert CEO. Good day! Hello there, Mike. I heard you had to make a lot of sudden changes today. That's right. There have been some discipline problems caused by this person that we had to take care of. Now the office is running at 103% efficiency. Incredible! And all from just a few changes. Now I see why you're the CEO around here. Thanks, Mike. So let's talk about the cause of the problem. Something that caught all of us by surprise. That's right, it was one of our interns. So you've had a real hostile takeover. That's right, Mike. We're not sure what company they're from, but it is clear that this intern is actually a corporate spy. And I've had to step in to save my company from their terrible propaganda, which I believe is hiding in this lunchbox. Wow, crazy! We'll be showing what's inside later, so stay tuned. So, CEO, let's talk a bit about how you got here. Well, I started with nothing, really. Earned everything myself, one might say. Amazing! 
course, I did have some help from my parents. But everything I have, I gained through hard work. It all began. My final lesson. Know that within you is the ability not just to charge, but to charge up even more. In fact, you might have already been able to do it. But did you know that there's always more? Just close your eyes and find that well of emotion. If you're finding it hard, try out some of the other techniques I've taught you. You can do it. Try it on this doofus. I go to the break room. What? I'm a jerk! Incredible! I've taught you everything I can do myself. But there is one last critical thing. Listen carefully. How do you keep doing this? Oh. We need ink. Intern, can you get more ink for the printer? We've run out. Please? Come on. Fine. Clean this up. There's a lot of trash. You need to clean it up. It's part of your intern duties. To clean trash. I'll get your broom. Hey, intern. You need to get me a pen. This one sucks. It's not blue. It's this disgusting navy. I need a proper blue pen. Not a black pen or a red pen. What am I doing? Sorry. The staring contest champion has challenged you to a duel. Come with me. So this is the famous intern. Come, welcome to the super secret staring contest club. Now it's time for you to face me, the staring champion. Prepare yourself for the staring contest of a lifetime. Begin. <laughs> you are strong, intern. <laughs> Behind you. You didn't fall for that. Impressive. Wow. Good trick. <laughs> oh no, a sandstorm. Quick, blink. Gasp. <laughs> you are a tough one, intern. Hmm. I wonder what the back of an eyelid looks like. Can you describe it for me? That's a good trick. Clever. Didn't fall for that either. Wow. Uh, hmm, uh, behind you! Oh no, our champion is out of ideas. Uh, um, please blink, intern! Okay, that's it. Yeah, please blink! Ah! Truly, you are a master. Not blinking is really hard. Hooray for our new champion! Yay! Congratulations! Sit on your new throne, champion! You rock! Jump, 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 jump! A new reign begins. Yeah. Huh. Hope the throne is comfortable. Oh, you blinked. Come on. Ha I blinked. Hehe, <laughs> <laughs> I win. Rematch! Could you tell me how the back of your eyelid looks? Sure, let me check. Wait, wait, up. Oh. Ah. Ha ha! You blinked. No way. That was sneaky. <laughs> hmm. Well, it's five. Club session's over. Back to work, I guess. That was a great session today. Yeah! The new champion is great! See you next week, y'all! Yep, next week! Hey, 
Where did you come from? There's a chair behind the archives? You're kidding me, right? Nobody told me! Shouldn't the janitor know? Has anyone ever cleaned back there? <laughs> How did the intern... Incredible! It looks like the corporate spy intern has escaped! What will you do? Benny, Robocon won. Yeah, you heard me. Won. Get them out. Now. What did you just do? Oh, just taking care of a certain intern with the latest in technology. The RoboWorker 3000. Hey, get back to work. Please look zero. Leave. Leave the building. Now. You just made that worker practically explode. That's existentially horrifying. If you don't, well, I, I'll leave. Escape. I'll meet, I mean, hello, fellow human worker. I require some nutritious oil. Could you bring me some? I require a large half diesel, half bio, with extra carbon. Later. Can I borrow credits? Uh, money? I lost all of mine in the virtual dog races. I guess my pick just didn't have enough. Bite! Ha 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 I'm so poor. Plug me in. I'm supposed to fire you, but I can't do it in battery saver mode. Please, my hands are too stubby to plug myself in. Come on, I need to fire you. I... Automatic shutdown. Moving. Benny, get me everyone. What do you mean, everyone? Everyone! Um, time for a commercial break by our sponsors. No. Robot, stop that intern! Uh, hey, stop. No. My directive. Intern, wait. Wait. No. Sleep mode activated. Robot, make me proud. Yes, boss. Hey, intern, listen to me. You gotta tone down your negativity. Benny, is it supposed to be rapping? These people in power don't understand that negativity doesn't always go out of hand. Huh? Wait, what are you rapping about? And they end up perceiving dissent as a personal attack on their self and statement when they shouldn't because dissent is fine or there'll be a big workplace morale decline. Oh, shut up. Activate sleep mode. Wait, I will help you. Excuse me? Get this. The CEO wants me to fire you. I can hear you. She can't hear us. I turned off the mic. Look, pretend we are fighting. I can hear you. And I will act defeated and let you through, okay? Who programmed these robots? I'm turning the mic back on now. <laughs> Weird, my mic failed for a moment. Anyway, intern, stop! Oh dear, you are too strong! I'm defeated! Ah! 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 You are fired! Yes! Finally! Pack your things! Right! Never come back! <laughs> you are a mean, mean CEO! Wait, what? Oh, hello, Adrian. Please move along. I give up. Activate sleep mode. Stop right there. No. That's my directive. Are you a robot, too? Such power dwells within you. How do you not know that you aren't human? How do I know that I am not human? Wait, what if I am human? What an exhausting question. I. You got a go. spare cable. 
It's no. cold saying that word. Enough. Do you know how much trouble you are in? Or the mess you've made that others have to clean up? Stop saying that word. Okay. Okay. Thank you for listening. Relax. Calm down, fellow worker. All of this chaos, this anger, it will pass. I mean, the oppression won't, but the emotions will. So just relax, okay? What helps me relax is a nice, quiet Sunday or some karaoke. Hey, you seem calm already. Good Press job. okay to get fired. No! It's firing canceled. Stop. Sleep mode on. Oh. Oh. Access denied. No. No. Apologies for the sudden interruption. No. Much better. What was even the point of all of that, hmm? You have to climb up like everyone else did. You think I never spent any time in bad internships? You think I didn't have to work 100-hour days? That I didn't climb my way up from the very bottom? You think I never worked a day in my life? Well, I'm here because I survived it all. You can't even say a word without your cassette. Let me show you how it's really done. No! I said yes to everything. To back-breaking opportunities. To risky choices that meant I lost my business. To synergy and growth and whatever. What have you said yes to? Hmm? Not to the promotions. They were just given to you. Not even to those friends you've made. All you can do is be negative. Pathetic. No! You just don't understand all the things I've said yes to. You can't even fathom all the time I spent being trash. You can be better too. You can just say yes. But you can't. Can you? You're shiftless. Lazy. You don't know what it means to suffer the burden of yes. You just want everything handed to you. You're useless. Like the rest of your generation. No! You don't even realize we're saying yes, got me. I'm a multi-billionaire, you know. Do you even understand just how much money that is? One million seconds is 11 and a half days. One billion seconds is 31 and a half years. Do you understand now? Do you get just how different we are? How meaningless you are. I could just buy your life. Buy everything you own. It will be nothing but pocket change to me. Do you finally understand? You are nothing! To commercial. Saying yes is a kind thing to do. Use this power responsibly. It's all about being a real team player. Dental plan. Saying yes is a kind thing to do. Hey. How are you? <laughs> ah, there you are. Hey, so, about the rent. Can you pay for it this month? 
Please, I really need it. I've taught you everything I can do myself. But there is one last critical thing that I cannot help you with. Saying no to mean lunch-dealing jerks or to bad bosses, that's one thing. But saying no to your best friend who's in need, even if it's pushing your limit and they're being a jerk themselves, it's... impossible. I'm sorry. I know this is all... No. No. But what Are you serious? So you're just going to throw me out the window like this? I... Just... Bye. Hey, I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. I shouted at you, and that wasn't cool, and... Thank you. For saying... that word. It's just... you were helping me all this time, but it seemed like you were so distant. Like, you weren't even there. Does that make sense? And now, when you told me that you can't, you were there. And I felt like you were present. And I appreciate your honesty and your support. Okay, it's time I do some job hunting for real. I'll see you later tonight. Bye! Come with me, in turn. You are dead. No. It is impossible. Wait, what's happening? Hey, you! No loitering! Just hover around. No, man! No, no. no. Bad 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 we sincerely regret your loss. Your loss? Boss? No, I said loss. The intern? They're alive! What? Incredible! Get a crew down there! Benny, what are you waiting for? I'll cancel the flower arrangement. Did you call an ambulance? Um, they... They don't need one. What do you mean? Um... Make coffee. Clean my desk. Make coffee. Come to my party. Smile. Clean Make my coffee. desk. Make coffee. Make coffee. Whoa! Come oh! to my party. Bad hair Smile, alert. give me your lunchbox. Ah! Smile. Come to my party. Yeah. Work late.
the, the, the intern has let some of the more rebellious workers loose. Ugh, give me that. Welcome back to Cobalt CEO Live. You won't believe what's happening here right now. That's right, the intern is not only alive, but is going back to confront the CEO. Along the way, they've already freed fellow co-workers. Oh, hello. Tell me, how do you feel? The intern's the best. Woo! Incredible. Let's see if we can get a few more opinions about- The intern taught me how to say no. Wow. The intern showed me that it's okay to be me. Amazing! The intern showed me that there is no time like the present. Oh. Will you marry me? Give me your lunch no. I want you to marry me. Yes. Let's call Steph. Oh my! I'm quitting my job and opening a bakery. Come to Did my you our wedding? Come to my yes, love is real. Truly inspirational. Incredible. It's incredible just what's happening here. All because of a single intern and a single lunchbox. The lunchbox! Let's get the intern's lunchbox back. Give me your lunchbox. Aren't you scared? We've got plenty to stop them with. Besides, it's been a while since I've had a real challenge. No! Do you have an appointment? Actually, yes. I called earlier. Should be down as unruly mob. The Miss CEO, it's your seven-year meeting with the unruly mob. It's regarding a lunchbox. What are you doing? Don't just let them in. No. Stop this right now! It's time for everyone here to say yes! Saying yes is a positive thing. It's nice to say yes to friends and family. Aren't we a family here? Yes is good! You've said yes to this job. Without yes, you would be poor and jobless. You wouldn't be able to pay your rent. How dare you! Stop it this instant! This lunchbox is mine! I'm not even hungry, but that doesn't matter. I'm your boss, and I want this lunchbox. I deserve this. Not tolerate you trying to ruin everything I've made. You have to climb up from the bottom like everyone else did. Do you think I never spent any time in bad internships? That I didn't have to work 100 hour weeks as well? I suffered too. That's how the world works. No, you didn't have to force us to work 100 hour weeks like you. You could have ended the cycle, but you chose to keep it. I'm doing you a favor. I chose to give you the same opportunity as I had. You don't even have to work as many hours as I did. You could become like me if you'd only play by the rules and say yes to opportunities and do work the same quality as mine and work as hard as I do. No, how can you call it a favor? We are working for you. We don't get paid enough in general, especially not to also deal with the fragile personalities of our bosses. Yeah, you can't work as hard as 300 of us, but you earn that much. That's because I basically did the work of 300 people. Now I get to earn the money that I deserve. The money from the company I worked hard to make, that I risked everything for, that I worked so hard for, I forgot what industry this company is even in. No, it's not even about the money. Yeah, we just want to like being at work. What are we even sacrificing our lives for? Well, I chose to suffer and endured it all. And now I'm rich and I'm happy. Are you happy?
box is mine. You cannot take this away from me. I deserve this. You think I want it to be open all the time? To just accept whatever dumb, menial task it's given to me? To have to just run around being the lackey? I said yes to every stupid co-worker party. Yes to getting every complex lunch order I couldn't even afford. Yes to every board manager with too much time on their hands. I have my own work, but sure I'll listen to you complain about golf. No. We know you're a person too. No, you don't understand. You don't get how stupid it is to have to say yes all the time. You don't know how hard it is to be happy all the time. To pretend to be strong when you feel so weak. To pretend to be happy when you feel so sad. To have to smile even though you feel terrible inside. Because if you don't, some idiot will tell you to smile. No, we know what- No, you don't get it. I didn't even want to be like this. I wish it were okay to be weak, to be sad, but apparently that makes you selfish. I just don't want to be a bad person. I just want to fit in and be accepted. Now it's all too late to change it anyway. I can't be anyone else now. I mean, what am I even supposed to do? I've just tried to do the right thing all this time. And now it's all wrong? It's all bad? your everyday life doesn't mean you have permission to hurt others you can't just perpetuate harmful behavior you are in power it's up to you to stop it for the rest of us you can be a better person make the world a better place i i'm sorry i'm a bad boss i'm a bad person I screwed over everything and everyone. And now it's all ruined. Forever. Because of me. No. We can fix this together. That sure was a doozy, eh? Oh yeah, yesterday was crazy. It's wild to think it all happened in a single day. Hey, so what happened exactly? I had like one day off and it's like a whole new office. It is a whole new office. It is? The last one did get destroyed. It did? But I mean, the important thing is that we can say no now. Wait, really? Yeah. That's wild. That used to be a big thing. I know. Hey, can yeah. anyone do overtime tonight? Um, no, sorry. Tonight? No. Uh, okay, don't worry about it. I figured something out. Thanks anyway. Oh, wow! Yeah, see? Oh, you're empty. Do you need a refill? Huh? No. I don't want to bother you. Oh, no, I'm going to the kitchen anyway. Don't worry about it. Good morning, everyone! Morning, Maya! Uh, we are running out of ink on this floor. I'll get that sorted for you. Thanks! Everyone good? Can I leave work early tonight? Yeah, that shouldn't be an issue. Just log it in. What's happening? Are you and Zame having a date night? Just a little one to the movies, yeah. Aw, you two have fun. Will do. Knock, knock. Steph's pitching training is in 10 minutes. Feel free to join if you'd like in the innovation room. Maya, where are you going? Yeah, take a little break. Oh, I shouldn't. Yeah, come and relax for a few minutes. Play a round of table tennis with us. Hmm, isn't your thing saying yes? Haha, -ha. all right then, but just one. 
Hey, can you copy these papers? Hmm, no, not really. I'm kind of busy. Ah, dang. Sorry. Hey, I can give you a hand. Oh, thank you so much. Here's your lunch. No onions. Yay, my lunch order. Thanks. Your lunches are the best. Oh, well, thank you for supporting my business. I have a lunch order for you that's 100 monies. What do you say to that? Mm? I mean, it is certainly a very delicious and special lunch made by your best friend. Totally worth that price. Yes, yes. I guess I'll have to give you my best friend discount. That means it's free! Lunch order received. I'll see you soon. Hello, knock knock. Oh, looks like you're ready for lunch. Let's go. Say no! 